Congratulations on signing your new Microsoft customer agreement. Today, we'll review the steps you'll take to move the billing for your existing Azure subscriptions purchased from Azure.com through the Microsoft Online Subscription Agreement, MOSA, to your new Microsoft customer agreement. This transition only moves the billing for your Azure subscriptions. The Azure resources tied to your subscriptions do not move, so the transition will not interrupt your Azure services. To get started, sign into the Azure portal at portal.azure.com with the same credentials you used to accept your Microsoft customer agreement. Click on the Cost Management Plus Billing icon. On the Cost Management and Billing page, you will see a list of your billing scopes and your billing accounts. Billing accounts are used to pay for Azure usage in your subscriptions. When you accept the Microsoft Customer Agreement, a new billing account is automatically created for you. Click on the link shown in the screen for a brief introduction to Azure Billing. Select the billing account type labeled Microsoft Customer Agreement. Click on Billing Profiles in the left pane. Select the billing profile you want to use. You will have at least one billing profile that is automatically created for your Microsoft Customer Agreement billing account. Click on Invoice sections in the left pane. Each billing profile contains one invoice section by default. You can easily create additional invoice sections to track your expenses and allocate costs. Click on the link shown in the screen for an introduction to organizing your costs with the Microsoft Customer Agreement. Select the invoice section where you want to move the billing for your Azure subscriptions. This is where the consumption for your Azure subscriptions will be transferred. Click on Transfer Requests in the left pane, and then add a new request up top. Enter the email address of the user you are requesting billing ownership from. This user must have an account administrator role for your old subscriptions. Then click Send Transfer Request. You will see a notification if the transfer request is successful. The user will receive an email with instructions to review your transfer request. The user will see this page when reviewing your request. The user selects the billing account with the subscriptions you want to transfer billing ownership for. The user can select the correct account from the drop down list or type the name of the billing account into the search bar. The user will select any subscriptions or other transferable products like reservations that will be transferred and will then click Validate. Once the subscription is validated as a transferable product, the user clicks on Transfer. Transfer progress is shown on the Transfer Details page. And that's it. You can now start using and consuming Azure under your new Microsoft Customer Agreement. To find in-depth articles on cost management, billing, and other topics for your Microsoft Customer Agreement, please visit aka.ms slash getstartedmca. Thank you.